lovely friends of Divine Days and hello to my lovely friends and family who are watching. This is what I've been working on this week. I've made a lamp out of cassette tapes. I've just turned the light off so you could, it's still quite bright outside just so that you can see my fabulous cassette tape lamp. And it's a great little project. If you're like me and you no longer have any tape players or tape decks and you're storing a load of cassette tapes and don't know what to do with them, you can make a fabulous lamp. So it's just a panel of three tapes on one side and either side to create a cube and then two tapes stuck together on the top and we have battery lamps inside. And it's just worked fabulous and I've put, I've stuck all of the tapes onto a base of a Dire Straits tape and Santana tape which I had to use begrudgingly to create this project. So give me one second while I just turn the light on and I'll show you how I did it. This one requires a glue gun, I'm afraid. I've tried other alternatives. Just leave it there for you to see. And I can't find anything that will stick the two tapes together other than a glue gun. So here's my glue gun, all hot and ready. And I have a protective board, which you can see previously, the glue has dripped onto the board. So when you use a glue gun, always make sure that you have a cardboard or board to put your glue gun on and protect all your surfaces. So, start off with one tape. For anybody who's been, who was born from 2005 onwards, these are what we used to play music on. And they're fabulous little things, but in our house we no longer have anything to play our tapes on. So I decided to keep them all together and make a fabulous lamp. I know. So, we start with one tape here. I've already glued these two together, but I'll show you how to glue it without knocking this part off. I don't know if you can see. Squeeze your hot glue onto the top of your tape. the part where the actual tape isn't showing like that. Take your other tape, or two in this case, because I've already glued the two together. And just hold in position while you wait for the hot glue to dry. And just press down. Now we have our first row of three tapes. Yeah, that's stuck nicely. So we need four of four of these panels of three tapes. So oh, I've moved it too soon. Let that dry there. To create this. So here I've stuck all of the tapes together on top and here and here and then once the three panels are glued I have just put some glue on this side and some glue on this side to keep them together like this. These tapes I've got from a charity shop and the whole lot I think was about £2.50 for all of these tapes. Apart from two, I just needed two to complete the project. And unfortunately that became Santana and Dire Straits. But we have Alexa, we have CDs, we have YouTube. I can still listen to the music, so it's fine. So that looks like it's set nicely. And this should be ready 
to just glue in place here. So, is it ready? Well, if it comes apart, you could just glue it again. I'm going to see if it's ready. So I'm just gluing the side here to put inside and just holding it together for a second. Just hold it. And I'm going to turn it over to let gravity do its part. Amazing. Amazing. Now I'm just going to move this one slightly over. I need to use that to prop it up. Can I? No. I'm just going to put some glue along this edge and then hopefully we can have our cube. I'm going to stick that up onto there. These little bits that fall out here, you can see, once they're dry, you can just peel them off. Press down. And we have a cube of tapes. So remember it's three tapes, just glued on top of each other, all the same way. So you want to start with your tape ribbon on the bottom and then placing your three tapes in four panels on top. And there we have it. Another cube light. So this one, like I said before, is stuck onto two cassette tapes, just to remind me that they are really good music for that one. And this one I've already glued to the top, which is just two tapes glued together in exactly the same way as I did before to go on the top. This one hasn't got a base yet, but we can still put the lights in. Lights from Poundland, battery operated. I'm pretty sure this isn't gonna be as bright as this one because these are clear tapes, but let's still try. These make great gifts for any music lovers. Oh, kind of. Well, let's just turn the light off again. Oh, yes. We have our two tape lamps. Aren't they great? So we've got the mixed ones with the black, the white and the clear here. And we have the completely clear ones, which do show up a little bit more light. Yeah. Fabulous gifts. If you're like me and you've got lots of tapes, or you do come across lots of them in the charity shop, then let's get sticking them together and make some great lamps. Great little thing to do. So I hope you enjoy making your... Um, cassette tape lamps. And until next time, take care. Bye-bye.